this whole thing of nine to five versus entrepreneur thing i know there's a whole buzz thing <laughs> everywhere at the moment like you need to become an entrepreneur and you need to do this trust me no. entrepreneurship is not for everyone okay i'm just gonna be honest with you right now entrepreneurship entrepreneurship is not for everyone it is hard it is tough and it's lonely there are times like when i'm like wondering to myself what the hell am i doing like what have i gotten myself into so all of the stuff that you know the hr um finance all of those departments handle you need to handle you are your own everything you know um, especially if you're starting off on your own, you don't have a partner, um, it can be really, really tough. You don't have like, you know, someone else from, I don't know, on your team to sort of like build you up or whatever. You need to be your own cheerleader, manager, discipline. It's hard, but for me, for me right now, I, it, this is, it, it's better. I'm busting my ass for my brand. A couple of people have asked me to elaborate further on, I think someone called it my road to success. Um, and I smile when I say that because for me, I'm like, I don't feel like I'm there. To be honest, I'm saying that because I don't know where I read it. I think it was a mix of Michelle Obama's book, Becoming, and some other things where it's like, you you should theoretically always be striving, especially if you are still considered young, especially if you're still in your 20s or your 30s or your 40s. If you have figured it out and you've made it or you believe that you've made it it's kind of like womp womp where else do you go from here so in a way for me i'm like yes i'm i'm very happy with where i am in my life right now at the same time i don't feel like okay you know i feel like if you say yes i'm successful you almost kind of like feel like okay i'm i'm done now i don't need to push i don't need to work there's so many other things that i want to do in my life there's so many like i think i mentioned it in one of my previous videos that i have all of these like little projects and and things like oh this would be great and this would be great and i want to do this i want to do that but i finally decided that you know what i don't think that i should get to a place where i feel like okay i'm good now i can share my story with people if that makes any sense because i think there's also merit in sharing as i'm going which is what i've been doing for everything else so why not look entrepreneurship for some people it's not for them and that's also okay i'm really not of this thought of like you are nine to fiver oh you know poor you kind of thing no no because it's not for everybody sometimes even for me i'm like i don't know i'm just seeing i'm, I'm trying something you know because some of my friends have called me like they're like oh you're so brave for doing this and stuff honestly the only reason why i have this like you know i'm like okay i need to at least give it a go is because of kai i became a mom and i was just like well damn i can if i can do that if i can bring a human into this world i can do anything once you know my hormones and everything settled i felt so powerful every single inch every single cell in my body changed and i was like okay i i'm like i'm I, I need to find my purpose. I need to focus. I need to do this. I need to do that. I need to, you know, stop wasting my life. Stop wasting my time. But if that's not for you, if you're not a hustler, if you know that you're not disciplined enough to do your own thing, to manage your own time, chase after invoices, all of that, then it's not for you. And that's also okay. We can all work. We don't all have to work for ourselves.